Ya bi ele tua atalo fatu nita yao ila to wo stay mo mo ne o tato ma futai ya ametele fali wela nipa fa talo fa ila nipa ma fa malo ya fa futai wo tato mo wo ma futanga nita yao talo fatu el fatu ya barua alo lava le soifo mon via barua ya mese fo ile pa ia tato kale si el nita yao bi ele tua fa futai ma futanga tama lo sunga ma va ya mese fo ile to au Ya walta pena ino al famo mo yo tama itayao ya vise pati mo tama ma aitema ma tango fie o e maka o kia kaka heo fatu sili ya wa ole basenga to e de leila na perform mesi itayao al fa ole ale tu amo ta to itayao fa ole tala ina fa pe god's divine calling for fathers ole aso ne ole aso fa pito amo tama and uh I often think o le tele of afita o le to tupune ya me se to meti o lo no no for la o le tele me fa le anga me la o le tele I often think that that those are from broken homes and most of the problems that is happening around the community is caused by people that have come from dysfunctional homes I think it's in Berati Mole, the Kale Sia Le Tua in a ya or Oina Tangata, Pef of a fear on a vea or ya masitama. You can father a child, but does not necessarily mean that you are a father. And so, Ola Fionga Lea Le Tua, my Otemanatu et Tauona, Fama Malama Yatato, Yamata for Yoyel Tangata, Tau Altama, a father. This is your divine calling from God. Let's firstly understand the Jewish concept of fatherhood and a biblical understanding of what it means to be a father. Ole a tonu la vale mele ta u ole tama a e pete mala malama fo i o tiu te fa tama o tiu te na vala au wai o ele atua pa i o e matama. Now the Hebrew word for father is Abba, and the Hebrew speaks of their dad as Avi. Ele ole Avi ho ele tele on to lua. In Aramaic, Jews commonly call their fathers Abba. The Greek word for father is Peter, and the Greek word Tata is Daddy. Now you gotta appreciate ole. Ole fenga inga tuai na tu sia elenga ngana e peru. Ole fenga inga phone na tu sia elenga ngana e leni. So the two languages are called the typical languages. So ole upuna le ole tama. The word Peter comes from the root ba, which means fa fonga mai. A daddy is a nourisher, a protector, and the upholder. A father does not mean that you happen to find a woman and you father a child and then have children and then be called a father. That is the common word given to somebody who has fathered a child. But the, the biblical concept of fatherhood is far different. A father may ultima is a nourisher. O yanga ke nourishing ale ainga. I am the living bread which come down from heaven. If anyone eats of this bread, he will live forever. And the bread that I shall give is my flesh, which I shall give to the life of the world. A father is somebody who points his children the only one that can satisfy the longings of human hearts. Number two, a father is a protector. Psalm 18 verse 2. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my savior. My, my God is my rock in whom I find protection. He is my shield, the power that saves me, and my place of safety. This is an example of what it means to be a perfect father. But if we can take God as the example, even if we can be close to 
I think that would be an achievement. Number three, God is the upholder. Behold, God is my helper. The Lord is the upholder of my life. Ole atua la, ole tamale na te uua ono tangata. Hallelujah, Jesus. <clears throat> I want to share eight responsibility of a of a father. Kele aisi mea, but let me just share eight. Ole me mo mua la, a father. Is a spiritual leader in the family. Ole tama oia ole tai tai fa le anganga i tutono lo na ainga. The primary responsibility of a father is to lead the family spiritually. Ole makafa i oinga le tama e fa i tutono lo na ainga ole tai tai i no lo na ainga fa le anganga. Ele ka i ka i se fa fine. Now, most families, women will take the children to church, and the father doesn't do his job as a leader, and as a spiritual leader. But <laughs> But here's, here's, here's what I really want to mention. A father is somebody that will cut, cut off generational curses. Ole matafa yo yel tama lava oe o oel tama ito tonu lo ainga o oe te tamo tua ia fetu ito tonu lo ainga. Fia ni tupulanga na pape na na maye ni fetu ito tonu lo ainga. A father, your job is to completely cut off generational curses. Aiva aile mena faya apera amo na faya apera amo le mena mo longa ainga. Number two, that God called fathers to start generational blessings. Avonga mai ol tama na te motu siya fe tuu na au mai tu pulanga i to tonu lona ainga. Ol tama foi na te a mataina manuia o tu pulanga i to tonu lona ainga. Ele e faia esse se camalo a ole meia ngar camai fai. Ala vela vela ele to hotel o tanga te ele mala mala mai la ko makafa yoi. If you want your family to be completely disconnected from the generational curses of many generations ago, ola u job nai fai ole tamotu e oe fe tu u to tonu lo ainga. Ai a matta e oe fa manu yango tu pulanga i lo ainga. A father is somebody who introduced God to your children. It is very sad. Ele introduce ele faya nga luenga le altama o le introduce o le atua ilana fa now. Yeah, fa fita ya ile atua na isi tanga for me. Uh, I think my dad introduced church to me, but he didn't introduce God to me. Hallelujah, Lord. Al makafa yo yel kamai kamo fai as a spiritual leader. Your job is to introduce God to your children. Ole tama na te fa sinu le atu e la na fa now na te fa e la na fa now. This is God and go save God. Afanga la tau le soto e tolu fai upo yono iya. Oh, if I pay my phone, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, I want to go to the Lord to my, 
fe mai ole tuo apa amo o isa ako mai yakop e tolu tupulanga au au na ile tuo e tota si male matafa yo ya apa amo na fai ole indo tiu so le tuo ilona tali alu lolo na tali indo tiu so le tuo ilona tali kolu kupulanga o fa manu yanga na mafu mai ona ole mena fai ya apa amo yu tonu lon ainga what a beautiful thing there are many generational curses that is affecting many families, and many families are struggling. Angala like an elo, wa a few will come with Faisa Mia. I buy a quiet salad of gas, I say, Angale Fayano, you give a kama. Your job is to lead your family spiritually. Ole tote la la tanga ta la wo fai la tota ito lua ai le mana mana mai la ko maka fai yo i ka ko fai ta ma ola nga lu nga fai ole into choose ya uma o e na e au au na ile tuwa ala fo e au au na fo ile tuwa lo wa tali uma lo wa tali e la au au na lo na fo e ya tali ile tu a o to ba ba ai na ile me la wa yai tu sa na uma lo ke la e ka le sia Toya na ito ina mama tuwa e umalo to ina na abu kau le ingu pulang alu inga umalo tanga tena wale lo pola ni si mela to tu puli si tu pulang Hallelujah Lord ole tama ola umata fa yo e fa i ole indo juice ole tuwa ilau fa nau Amen ya uma oye te au na le tuwa ala fo e follow ma ilau fa nau le au na step wa ya na isavadi I am the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob. Three generations. Blessed. What a beautiful thing. All over here to Emmanuel, allow to Pulanga, Emmanuel to Pulanga, allow for now, Emmanuel to Pulanga, our grandchildren. Isaac worshiped the God of his father because his father did his job. Jacob worshipped his father's God because Isaac introduced God to his son. Your children will worship God if you do your job. But the very person, the immediate person that introduced God to the children, Allah Susunga. Number two, fathers are the provider of love to your wife and to your children. Let them experience love inside the house, not anywhere else. Experience it It's so dysfunctional. There are four types of love in the Bible. Stoke, parents' love. Phileo is the friendship love. Eros is a couple's love. Or alofa na etolu. They are human love and they will all fail because it's based on human circumstances. But the love le mana o mia fi experience tonal jato a ingo le alofa, the unfailing Love of God, the unconditional love of God. Husbands love their wives like Christ loved the church. Love your wife like you love yourself. Exactly the same thing at the town of responsibility in Amaya let your wife experience the love of God, the unconditional love of God. Let your children experience it inside the home, not anywhere else. 
Momoko ni to suma cholo fa upe fa ele fitu love is patient and kind love is not jealous or boastful or proud or rude it does not demand its own way it is not irritable it gives no records of wrong uh, it does not rejoice about injustice but rejoices whenever the truth wins out love never gives up love never loses faith it's always hopeful and endure through the very circumstances kokia le lo fa le fa Ale ala fa le lema na ole tu wa ta una provide ta malo lo e to no lo na ainga la na fa na u malo no to lo number 3 love discipline their children yo ole ala fa discipline na ifa fa mate mate ole ala fa le na sa sa o e e per resul ma lo fa pas folo for our earthly fathers discipline us for few years doing the best they knew how but god discipline is always good for us so that we might share in his holiness famul molal fasamo awa ila to na la to wa ima ya ita to ina ya so ititi ilo la to fa italia peta ya ne o ya wa o ima o ya o nga ya ita to na ya to fusia ita to ila na miole lei wa o inga uma fo ya o ya ile manatu ya yo se me ori ori ai au le me fa no no ai mun mun ya ne e fu ma ya ile fu o le mi o to no e manu ya ai e wa o o inai altamala ola nanga lu nga fa yo le discipline ola na fa na ale discipline de tamaiti olong o vinga ola makwa ke yo sa altama ola na mata fa yo e tau na fa e de tau na discipline na fa na e tau na fa tonu ta metiti le mete tau na na u yai le ta to ba ba ai le tala le na fa tino na nei e fe so yo no fa yo pe fa fathers do not provoke your children to anger but bring them up in the discipline and in instruction of the lord but may i want to fatty nga ila fa now i will find a fat to pull it ya ila to aya wa ila to we to some ala ola to and i all life will tell me titi le if you fear ya te hallelujah lord very often in my son and for appeal for upon ala to what i say but not as i do It is best that the children will see the great examples that you set for them. Ole mevo ninge ol discipline ya elaya masika ma kike fie fie ya. A ole fa mai tala tu sipa ya ya nga eti nga la timine a ya nga le numa na. Ba fitai fo ile tu ol fu sipa no fu ya. O wa te lo te le ala nga fu sipa. Ole ke le fa la isi tanga te ele fie fie le fu sipa. A ole fa fa mai tu sipa ya a a wa ifo ita to wele tu wa. Ya ngai ke lo e yai ke me ke lo ngo ngai pe wo mo o mai le fusi pa o le tu ya tu o yo no le sta o le me ala ka mo fel kanga o le salamo but basically o le matafa yo ilo le discipline e le se matafa yo e se tina e fa yo le matafa yo ina le tama e ta uno fa i to no lo na ai number four yellow number four fathers ya ngai se se nga wo lu ko fathers are the protector of his wife and his children Ole tama o ia ole pui pui po o ia ole leo leo la no to lua mala na fanau e va fonga mai policemen and your neighbors are not the protector of your wife but very often ya e pe e ole ka loka isi tanga to ona wa 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 bi le fine ya le leo leo ona la wa le fa ya le tama lo ala na chop to na fai ola na chao beto na fai ola protect ele ole le ole o ele ole le ole ole ma lo ele ole ola uto lua ola u suma eo a ya tama ba ta no felici tama ele si tama ma e fai ele o se le ole ole ma lo ele ole ola uto lua ola u suma ele ole o ya al mele fai ya ta to ya etele ya ta to lua e vidi el fafinga le leo leo a wa wa ilo le finga le pawa nga le tanga te sa wa i ma fi le mu wa ya ma le o ma ya le fasi lo na tino o le vidi le leo leo ya e le se ma ka fa yo le leo leo nga o le ma ka fa yo le tama ta no fa sexual abuse of daughters are by their own biological fathers e le ma faina na ti al me le wa o le tu tu pu me your hands protect your children Fathers should be the hiding place for wives and the children. Salamato suma lo fa pe fitu. 
For you are my hiding place. You protect me from trouble. You surround me with songs of victory. And we should copy that. New King James Version of my, you shall surround me with songs of deliverance. Ole Tamala, Olana Matafa Yo Fai Ole Lafi Olon to Lua Malana Fa now. Number six oh. Fathers are the provider for their families. Ole Tama Ola Matafa Yo Ole provide Molo Ainga. Afonga Matama. Wife is Isha, woman. Now, the woman is the keyboard of life. Wife is the helper. Oliver Fine was never designed to work to provide for his family. But if you go back to the Bible, the mother was never designed to work. Amen. Amen, church. Women were never designed according to the Bible. She's the keeper of life. Her job is to have children. Man is ish. If I tell the connection in the time of the Fasalang and the Fasala, the two are Tamu, Kongeki are Tamu, the Lowell Ele, and all the Matafa Yoya are Tamu, the Faya Ele, the two are all in a Lue, the Lowell Ele, provide more on Ainga. Genesis 3, verse 17 to 19 clearly states that man's job is to work on the land. All the Matafa Yoya, the Mafa, or the provide more on Ainga. Lua Timo as Momoti Moto Lima Faupe Valu. Fafonga Mai, Famal Vamul Motive, Tama Momolfa Samo, yeah. A file a tossi se tassi luna ainga. A foy for ele city on a tossi ye mau baia. Wafa fitia a yell fat to a tua. A city for ilona leanga ille wale fat to a tua. Yeah, or opula le tua, Famaya. I lay my fire setangata and provide more luna ainga. I may say that I told you that my father is from my oia oia fafitia le fatua tua. My worst shaku kanga kale anga lo tanga tele tel tongo le tua. Ya kaki ala isi mafu anga le mewa le ina le providing al tamalo. But fundamentally, a father's job is to provide for your family. If you don't, then you are actually worse than an unbeliever. Yeah, this is not my word. This is the word of God. provide molon ainga. Oia ya lwe fai nga lwenga e su e male tupe e ola e nona inga. Oia nga ke tisain inga. Oia nga ke fai ya umma mea e fa ape nga unga generate ele income ina ia mo fai ona tau si e lona inga. If any father is not doing that, vanga nga hai situation e waka kau makala fai ngai. For example, pe wai mat. Wai le mfai no tau fai nga lwenga. In that case, understand it too. But fundamentally, all tala to spaya ale ma faya stangata on a provide molong a inga my e way sakuna than unbeliever. Now, if you're strong enough to go to work and you're not doing it, you are failing the faith. Me fa ale te faya tu a kako le o e faya me le merku spaya e kele ano na faya no tato ang ay lengi upo sepi upo yala fiyong pa ele tu. If you are not able to provide for your family. Number four, number seven. Father is the priest. Ole tama ole faita ulanga ole na ainga. Yo polo na mata mo mo fai upe lima fa mole mole faita umai. Wa umala unga aso ola to tausaminga. Ma luatu le ole fai awa yoku. Ma na fa pa iya ina ila to. Sa chula yo iya ni ta ya olava. Ma na fa iya ta ulanga mu fa ta ta ulor. Ole 
ole nanga luenga le ole faita ulanga molona ainga ole talala alusipa ia ilimena faya yopu mama kaya uma e aluto ina e faila na faile taulanga e kofuluka makiki male 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 manu e faya el taulanga molona mafa fa ike uanga sala tama tama titi ile atua ala matafa yo yanga ia le le traditional le choose e te tau on alu ta ma e faila na taulanga awala na fa nau ina ia awana ile ya ule langi se tama titi Hallelujah, Lord. Fathers, along with our faith, faith that I have, you must get up and present the sacrifice for your children. How? Through prayer. Fathers, your job is to get up in the morning and go before God and present your family before the Lord. Mo faya tu la lemele, anga ele o ma faya experience uma tamale me de tau ona yai. Le oli oli ma fi fi ele ma yele tu. Fathers, your your job is to guard the anointing atmosphere at home. You represent your family before the throne of grace. You petition for the needs of your family. Ola ma kafa yo ile ta ma e ta una fai e te hala e ta yao e te halu lu mo le tu e ave le ta ulanga mo lo a inga lo tu lu ma la fa nau every morning e te ta una e fai ana na me Ala va ave la vela e le mo fai na fai u ma ta ngata bara e te halu pa u wa le me le ma ma fai ma fo ta ngata o le provide me ai ma super a pena but basically o le me pick up ceiling a ka u wa le te ta una fai ta ma to go before the throne of grace every morning. I challenge any father, any father, to go before God. The first thing you do in the morning is you get up in the morning, you go before the Lord and present your needs, petition for your family. Hallelujah, Lord. I wanted to catch now so that's the reason why I will want to present them. Why they may find a cow feel for the love of two people are very much. I'm a fail of the town of the house. I'm a fine. I usually die out. But be an honor to a two little more there too. Oh, yeah, like I want to kind of get a kill on one look at the other. But if you if you systematically, if you consistently do that every morning, Hallelujah, Lord. Believe me, I I last week a kilo kilo I I soul me lay to turn all away. Number eight and the last. Fathers are the role models for their families. Hallelujah, Lord. Elu ala me le is either role model or me alianga. I a po role models or me tau le langi. They are allowed to tell a no to tell a tama or oil a role model a available a inga ili langi. You are supposed to be the role model. Your children will follow you. Fafitai le tua ya waia wa utiltilo fafitai le tua motavale. A role model for me. Thank God for Ene Sangala. Thank God for William Mulavina. Thank God for Andy and Leone. Hallelujah, Lord. These people were my role models. Okay, I will write here role models. I look at their lives and I try to copy what they do. Fathers are spiritual leaders of a wife and children. If it's a honor for your father, I'm a Molea. Oh, Tota Mafoi. I want it to far on Ono to ya or Tofa now. Kaya Tosia to Yaya or Inga, Mapo Inga, Lady. Matala to spoil your uncle Kifa on Ongo to meet. I want I to far on Ono. I fight on my fa. Wow. I found my to meet. A little Sasa oil found Ongo Papa Pia. Or the confronter, no, you need to be confronted. If something is not right, a man out merely confronted. Oi, because I live for you, a little yellow room. It will only be uh, before you you see um, nasty disasters. 
e manga o mia le confronto il tamititi le mesi se le fai nge ke la wo fa o pe tamiti fa pe o lo fa o no no le le wo nga le me ba no no we le o fa o ngo le fa sa o el me ta una yai that's called discipline and directing you bad habits will destroy your future hallelujah lord my father ole mata fa yo ya ta to ole fa yo ole fa yo ta to ma ro moro sa ta to wa ile ile ka u fa ka ka ie ka me ki isi me kwa ko fa longo kala la oliva a wo ke alu ke pi ya suru ape ma wo ke pi ya ya ai la ngai ele ngai but i tell you what if your if your children can see your life And in fact the best thing you could do is just live your life for the Lord and let them see what you do. Ke leva isi ke mi leka o ke fi wa su e pola al mele ling fa pela ka meki. But you know the bottom line is o ka ko wa o ka ko wa la ti ti ta meti e pe yo isi ba ke mi o meka meki e ya a fa yo ka ko la nga meki a la a la ngo fo meka meki mi laya yo laya yo laya yo laya Hallelujah Lord. E e ko akele longi ro moro. Believe me, society society will be so nice to live in. Kene solo no mata upo lu suma lu fa upo ono afongala to le sibe manaya le iya. Wa ami fo ya pro amol fo fie fo ya le tawo ngamu. Ma fa e ya ya isa akolo na tadi. Wa ami fo ya ya lo na lima le afi ma le polo ona o ai leo ila uo. Amen. The most beautiful thing. But my little two spa yo, while I too ya, ya, ya upper arm. Oh, ya lend the fetter lie, ya ilia too. Too old for fear, no natalie. Meaning, children also carry some responsibilities. But my little two spa yo, and they walk together to the place of sacrifice. And the male and man, ya ya ya, for it is in. To so less of a is a cook, I lay low is a cold male, a cupul lumai. Alessa Mali Upper Amo, try lonely Upper Amo, the Mele Atupu. He knew that he was going to lose his son. But Olona, Olona, Loto Lana, every step was painful. I found a Mela, and if I make a lie Upper Amo, Lona Tadi, the Mele Atupu. He just took him and they walked together. He never told him what was supposed to happen. Wako ake iyalo na tali ino watu wa pu eloto ino say say wako a ilo a ilo tama titi le mele la tupu. Hallelujah Lord. But you can imagine it must have been the most painful trial that Abraham had ever crossed in his path. Olongo winga every step towards a place of sacrifice was the most painful step. But they walk. Ava fonga la oto le mele pito si nta uwa. Ole ole mea silinga kawa ya per amo ole usita ile mele na fa maya ile atua even though his son was about to be lost and maka ukia la le mele na o ole lunga fa maya tala le atua le awo o lo now I know Abraham now I know ele ilo le atua ole vanga ilo le atua but literally doing what the Lord said and Taking his son together with him, walking together to the place of sacrifice, was one of the most amazing things Abraham had to do. Ngao ay ofa malia tuwa apera amo lea wa uloa malo malia tuwa apera amo. I am going to bless you and your children. What a beautiful thing. Okay, Lord, as a father, the most. Amazing thing, okay, no fuck more mama for is what will happen when I'm gone tomorrow. And I'm I'm praying that the Lord God will take my children and follow the same footsteps. There's nothing in the world. I okay for you, literally, a kealwanga oele hai masemia. What we need to do is to do what lasts into eternity. That's where we're supposed to concentrate on. And lastly, fathers are dads. Tama, you are dad. 
you can father a child, but doesn't mean it doesn't automatically mean that you are a dad. There are many fathers, but it takes a special man to be a dad. Are we in Hebrew means father. And often reflecting the hopes, the blessing, the characteristics sought by a child. Avi in Latin means my father. It carries a sense of familial connection. It just really melts my own heart. When any of my children say, Dad, that's when I feel the close connection. A commentator saying, these are the Bible commentators. The word Abba, which means daddy, is used three times in the New Testament. Once in Galatians chapter 4, verse 6, once in Mark 14, 36, and once in Romans 8, 15. The use of daddy in Galatians was to help move the believers out of the slave mentality into a son mentality. slave mentality Father, you can be a father, but not necessarily a dad. Galatians 4 verse 6. And because we are his children, God sent the spirit of his son into our hearts, prompting us to call out, Abba, Father. Daddy, Father. And I often look at my own life as a father. I'm asking, Ya Ulava Ya. Are you a father? Are you just a father? Or are you a, a daddy? Ola la la o me ala fa ila fa nao. Pe la ta la ta mai la fa nao ya te oe. Pe ma ma la fa nao ma oe. Will determine the difference between a father and if you are a father, you are the father to the children, but your children are not close to you. A daddy is somebody who is very close to his children. And I tell you, ole finanga lo le tua ina iya fa pe na na fa la la ta ta to olo loto malo fatu ile tua malana nga luenga malo lo fa ile tua will all be mimicked by your children. They will copy your heart. Ole me ala ba ta wa ya ke oi ole me fo na ta wa la fa na o e te lo fa le tu e lo lo fa fo la fa na o le tu e ke le lo fa le ku e fa pe ra fo i ma la fa na Your commitment to the Lord your children will follow God is the best daddy that we can ever have Don't te fo ie le ni la to ma tu I tell you to have God as your daddy is the best daddy anybody can have Amen. You know, when women call their husbands dad, yeah. You can't call your husband your dad. But you know, if your daddy's a daddy, by all means, go ahead and call your husband daddy. Obviously, your husband is very close to you. Something amazing will happen in our families. I know that I know, without a shadow of doubt, if I know you to and do what you were called to do as a father, Something amazing will happen to your children. Ola ulu ifo ile ya teo to wia tamala iti. 
why don't just be a dad. Lead your family to the Lord. Lead, show them what it means to save God. Show them the way. Wa o loa uya. Eleai mase me o tutoi de la lolangi motato. Believe me, if you're not careful, your children will become teenagers. And that's when you hit the problem. That's when you see the chaos. If they don't know the law, something amazing will happen. And I tell you, we are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. I'm seeing that in my family. I'm seeing that in my, my brothers. And I'm, I can only grieve and pray and hope that God will help them. Hallelujah, Jesus. There's no God in the family. What will happen tomorrow if you die? Everybody will end up in hell. Hallelujah, Jesus. Let's do the job that God has called us to do. I challenge you and I encourage you. Be a father to your wife and your children. Lead them spiritually. Ta'uya Yesu. Live as an example. Hallelujah, Lord. Be the priest for your family. Provide for your family. Do the best you can. Hallelujah, Lord. We inherit every, we, mean we, we store up the treasures for our children. When after us, at least, the best thing I would want to give my children is not material things. The best thing, okay, I will not Hallelujah, Lord. That's the two lot in my nature. Hallelujah, Jesus. Tell me now for you. Nature, I want to to two. I think it is imperative for fathers to understand your responsibilities as a father to your wife and to your children. I want to have a say earlier to what you don't know about Ainga. I want to have a say earlier to what you don't know about Ainga. Let God be the king of your house. Let him be the God of your house. If I had to have Makauki Aleman wheel in Umanai, I am a fire on our veil at two armor, take Tayo low wine. A formal teller to spare the head of the woman is the husband, and the head of the husband is Christ. I'll tell you, I've a pet to Maule men I to turn on Ainga. But the structure level woman are made at two or they are two or the head or the malo alpha phenol on a head or on the tall meaning that my head will obviously bless me if I submit and surrender my life. But if that's what the ma you need to surrender your life to the Lord, you need to surrender your life to the Lordship. The leadership of Jesus Christ. Yautina, you need to submit to the leadership of your husbands. Ole structa na divinely na mayele tuwa if I be now the tai tai yo tato wai. Hallelujah, Jesus. Fathers, I ask you to lift your hands to the Lord. 
And O Taylor, on a responsibility, on a responsibility, Leo Almai, while my yatato, Molite, no tato, I know. O Taylor, while I found a sino tato, will let two up at tattoo to two yonalum, Pena Fayo tato, chute pele. See old Lima, they love the tal, Faya Umasui, that over I will let two on the Tama. Even I stand here and I know that I fail you so many times as a father. I ask you for your forgiveness. We ask you for your forgiveness, Lord. Daddy, we surrender our lives to you. We ask you to give us the wisdom, the knowledge, the understanding. Oh my for yai mato le tu ale le poto malea tamai e ma faye na te te ino mato ai nga tu samo wan fa mangalo imato we love you Jesus we honor you we know Lord God that without you we cannot lead our families without the Holy Spirit there's nothing we can do we surrender to you Jesus Father we surrender to you we ask you Lord that you'll help us lead us direct us and guide us Lord God as fathers not only in our families but in the church so that the glory and honor will always come to you Jesus there is none like you no one else can touch my heart like you children is to honor respect your wife because when you treat your wife properly not only that God will be honored but your children will love you more than your wife our job as husbands and as fathers is to honor and respect the mother of our children. I tell you, you will never question their love for our now. Yet, oh, be have a bit of honoring, respect, and treat your wife properly. You can also call the anointing into the house when that happens. They know that the parents love each other. A secure atmosphere like all I tell you, they'll be confident. You will see the confidence in them if you make sure that you love your wife and treat them properly, respect them. I may say, so well anointing you don't know. I'm going to in a treat night now. See, lonely, my dear, too. I wanted to thank God for your wives. Thank God for the mother of your children. Thank God for the responsibility that He has given us. It's an honor to be the leader in the family. It is a privilege. It is not something that you can take it for granted. When God chose you to be the leader of your family, when God chose you to be the father, 
It's an honor and it's a privilege. Sile oli malet. And I will pray. Shone. life and what he has achieved for the kingdom and for the purpose of the kingdom. Daily to a moto Tai Molitama wa e fili filia e tete ina la umanwenga in the neve tete. Fabitola mato fav daily to a yamalia to a my new po or no longer talia ina or the talalele. Fav time mola inga sa malia to a malangal wenga na fatino. Lord, I read the history and I know that most people that were very instrumental in the initial phase of mission in Samoa were the family of Maliator. May your name be glorified, Lord. I may say that you are the one who is 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 the the Father God, the Son God, the Holy Spirit. And it's in the constitution of the government of Samoa. Ave sa utaw lang apati le tuwa. Ono le tala le lei. Na umaya matalia ina ili nei aso. Fo ili vi inga ya toe. Bless you Lord, we thank you dear Holy Spirit. May the name of Jesus be glorified. God's people will shout. <laughs> 